I think the primary concerns of my research are bringing together issues about social class, ethnicity, religion and identities. And in various ways I've done that across the last 25 years. My um, doctoral thesis was about um, the education of the second generation Irish and I was drawn to that because I always thought it was surprising there was so little written about the separate existence of Catholic schools and their relationship to schooling the children of Irish immigrants in this country. And um, very little written about it and this was about the biggest immigration there's been into Britain in the last 200 years. And in researching it, it brought up those issues I've just mentioned about um, issues not only for Irish families and their kids going to the schools, but for the state wanting to shape the identities of immigrants and the role of the English Catholic and Scottish Catholic churches in um, collaborating um, both po in a positive and negative sense of that word with the state in trying to ensure that the children of Irish immigrants were educated. And it revealed it, quite interesting things like why are Catholic state schools publicly funded? In other Western democracies like France and the US, Catholic schools are automatically private and privately funded. And the reason for that is deeply related to the big immigration from Ireland at the time of the famine and the need to try and school these um, immigrants who were much needed labour, but there were many worries and problems attached to the children of those immigrants. And those, some of those themes have continued, so that subsequently yeah, I've done a lot of work on um, discrimination and the Irish in Britain for, I, for, for, for Irish actual migrants, and also much further work in a very um, intense sort of national, nationwide study on the second generation Irish and, and their identities, looking at places like London, Coventry, Banbury, Manchester, Glasgow, and noting the variations and the similarities. So for some time, all those original issues really preoccupied me. Although I'd say latterly, I've done far more research which is comparative, looking at the Irish in relation to other immigrant groups. Um, both in terms of generally about how do we understand the contribution of such a large uh, white immigrant group to the complex multiculture of British cities. And also, how do we really understand the experiences the Irish went through uh, during, in this country during the Northern Ireland Troubles? And we compared that with the experience of Muslims now. My research interests at the moment are largely in the field of modern and contemporary Irish literature and film and the overlaps between the two media forms between cinema and literature. A lot of interest in adaptation studies and how that uh, bears on modern Irish culture. I'm particularly interested in the uh, relationship between the emergent British Labour Party and uh, the forces of Irish nationalism, specifically Irish republicanism, in the period immediate, immediately after the First World War. Um, and that is uh, primarily between 1918, uh, the establishment of the independent Irish state in 1922, and the establishment of the first Labour government in this country in 1924, so a five or six year period uh, just after the First World War. My main uh, research interests are in film, film history, and cultural history. Um, I'm particularly interested in uh, curation, curation of, uh, of old films, um, how they're represented, uh, for example, uh, in film festivals, in retrospectives, um, but also in, more recently, I've been involved in uh, a DVD uh, project, uh, collating and curating uh, films uh, of one particular uh, director. And from that, I'm interested theoretically in um, issues of remediation and what we call uh, cultural transfer. So how do films from the past, um, what sense do they make for uh, people today, but also uh, what sense do films from and about Ireland, what sense do they make for audiences uh, on, on the other side of the globe, uh, for example, say in Brazil?